Late show band leader John Batiste is having a big year. The multi-talented artist recently returned to the Ed Sullivan Theater along with Stephen Colbert for their first show in front of a live audience since March of 2020. Prior to that, he's been busy. He released a <laughs> brand new album, and let's not forget the Academy Award that he won for the score on the Disney Pixar movie Soul. CBS 2's Dana Tyler recently talked to Batiste about that and much more. Oh. You know, when you hear someone singing over your shoulder like that, this is John Baptiste, and what a year you are having. Hello, John. Hello. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. I, I'm blessed, and I'm glad to be here talking with you. Thank you. You too. And uh, we're so glad to see you all back at the Ed Sullivan Theater. Uh, Stephen Colbert, Stay Human, you and human beings in every one of those seats. What's it feel like? Oh, my goodness. It's a celebration of life, and it's a celebration of the fact that we can be together. Mm -hmm. You know, I've not felt this feeling in 15 months and it's a reciprocal emotional relationship with the audience and 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 the performers and i've never understood that more so than i do now the difficulty during the pandemic not only of you know just thinking about what our fellow human beings are going through and compassion uh, but also of course we had the murder of George Floyd and just the outpouring, so many different things on um, equality. You were very involved in that. There's something that we all have, it's mm -hmm. the conscience, mm -hmm. you know? It's something that gives us the voice of our heart, the voice of God, the voice of the moral fiber of life, that is the thing that when we listen to it, we know what the right thing to do is. And we have to teach ourselves to listen to that inner voice with each generation. There are lessons that are old, oldest time. And these are things that everybody who is standing up for justice, everybody who's standing up for what's right, they're really just trying to remind us of those lessons, those timeless lessons of life and those morals that we all need to really adhere to to have the best life for everyone. We are your album. Congrats on that. Just came out earlier this year. And uh, boy, there's a little bit of everything in that. And I, I just was reading the lyrics. We are the golden ones. We are, we are, we are the chosen ones. It's so simple and so empowering. Tell me about that, this album. Oh, wow. Thank you. This album is um, is the product of so many of my ancestors' sacrifices and everything that they were able to do. And the human race is is chosen for for our time. Everyone who's around now is a chosen one. Mm -hmm. We have to make the choice of what it is that we want to do with our time on Earth. And this album is a celebration of that, celebration of life, a celebration of being able to make a choice and having the freedom to, to exist and to live and to make the most of this life. When I move my body just like this, I don't know why, but it feels like freedom. Freedom is an incredible video film in New Orleans. It has a, a, a real vibrance to it. I Need You, you know, that's another song we put out, and, and that was one of the singles. We reached number one on the radio Yay. with I Need You. And the video is just another Hmm. It's a joy bomb, I like to call it. Mm -hmm. Just see, you hear that song? We got a lot of living, we working overtime. Don't need another million, you got that gold mine. Ooh, you do, yes. You know that feeling, I'm I telling love you. That. That. I That's love it. that. Let's go with that one. Let's go with <laughs> that one. And the time that you spent during the pandemic working on soul. Yes. So what do you want to be remembered for? the creative process like when you're you know you're either working on a zoom or I don't know how, how did you do it well soul was done in a collaborative manner you know we had just an incredible creative family that mm -hmm. we we worked on this film for a couple years and we ended during the pandemic which uh, it, it had a lot of challenges in recording in sure. your living room for a major <laughs> studio score um, but we figured it out, and I think that the results speak for themselves. It came at the right time in the world. Yeah. Everything happens for a reason, and I really believe that that film um, and everything that we put into it came about at just the right time. 
Oscar yes. winner. Oh my goodness. Congrats on that. Before we let you go and get the melodica ready there. Can you play us out, John? Hello. Thank you. Thanks, John.